Hey everybody, it's Keepster. I figured I'd do a real quick uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! TC, well, like TCG card simulator, because that's the game that I've been playing a lot lately. So I wanted to show you how to mod this, and um, where I learn. Um, so the way you would mod, put like Yu-Gi-Oh! stuff into your TCG shop simulator is pretty simple from what I've learned. Um, so you would have to basically have this thing called that that pen X. And I'm gonna leave the link to where you can get this folder in the description. And within this folder you have to essentially download the um Yu-Gi-Oh folder where it has the obvious Yu-Gi-Oh mod and there's like a few out there. The one that I found is the most useful, and let me sort of just make this dark for a second because I don't want to get in the way. Um, so I'm getting to like the actual one that I'm using right now. There's two, but the one that I'm most focused on is actually this one. Um, so I'm gonna display window capture. And that's my private server, but uh, we're going to the mod that I'm using. So you would get this is the one that I'm using called Yu-Gi-Oh! Simulator for TCG slot. Um, you download this through this website. Um, and I'll link that in the description. And what you would do is going back to sorry, going back to display capture right here for a second. Uh, you go to Right click this, go to browse local files, and you will take a folder. Um, I went ahead and made a folder called TCG Simulator. Well, I call it like a mod because that's what that is. Um, yeah, so shot simulator. This is just as with mods. And you go into the folder here. You don't have to do what I do. Everybody has a different thing. Um, download this when uh, when raw or ex file. And all you have to do, rather I should say, you go into this folder. All you have to do is gonna have that folder in there. This doesn't matter. You can probably overwrite this. Or what I did is you copy this plugins folder. You go back to um, the folder where it has your data. So it's like you go into your Steam, Commons, go into here. Um, oh, yeah, don't worry about that. Um, forget about that. You go into your BEP and EX folder. Double click that and just replace the plugins. If you did this correctly, the game should load in just fine. So let me just show you like a demonstration of that real quick. So I'm gonna close display capture, go back to game capture. We're gonna launch TCG player right now. I'm sorry, TCG card shop simulator real quick. Um, and it's gonna launch. I'm just gonna make sure that we get the right one and there we go it's gonna load up whenever it loads up it'll take a bit to respond because well it should work because i was testing it yeah depending on your system it, it'll take quite a bit to load up it'll take less but yeah you should see this if you load it up correctly and then you don't even have to start a game you can just load up wherever you are and then just start you know wherever you saved last time and uh, it's going to load up yeah so we got you know Yu-Gi-Oh Monopoly Lego 4 album you got the Yu-Gi-Oh cards in here um, I sold some stuff earlier, so I have a lot of money. Feral Servant, and then you pull up like the uh, 
stocks you got like lb some of these are you know incorrectly like labeled i don't know how to fix that but for the most part like if you don't care about that attention detail everything is as you see um to work out so that's how i did it that's how i learned it um if you have any questions comment down below and i'll be happy to answer any questions so i figured i'd do this quick trip so i don't really see a lot of like Yu-Gi-Oh! mock tutorials so i figured i'd do my own anyway um so i'm gonna go ahead and exit this, um this game because we're kind of just done i just want to show you what i learned um but yeah if you guys have any questions let me know um and I'll probably be streaming this game relatively soon. I figured I could put a short tutorial out there for those that are trying to mod this game, don't have no idea what to do. Um, hopefully, hopefully my tutorial is a little bit straightforward, but if it's not, I'll clarify some things in the comments, let me know, and I'll see you guys next time, John Demons, and I'll see you guys into the next uh, video.